about to leave already packing come with me i'm not really asking we'll get away to a place where we don't know hey guys welcome back to my channel i hope you're having a great day just wanted to do a little casual video with you and show you what is in my fridge and do a little haul of everything that I got at Trader Joe's this week. Um, I didn't get a whole lot, but I figured I would show you guys. Um, I enjoy watching these types of videos. I love seeing what people find at Trader Joe's um, and just in general. Um, don't judge, <laughs> my fridge isn't the most organized at the particular moment, but I wanted to film this video and make it more like real life. So anyway, let me go ahead and show y'all what I got at Trader Joe's this week. I just finished up filming an Amazon video. Not sure which one is gonna go up first, um, but I will definitely link it um, if it's already up. P.S. I just got this sample in today. This is the color of my bridesmaids dresses. Can you see that? It's called French Truffle. It's like a really light, um, it's kind of like a brown. It's kind of like, I mean, it's like a truffle color. Um, it's pretty, I really, really like it. I think it's gonna look really beautiful against the um, florals that we're doing. Um, I just booked the florals the other day, so I'm really excited. I really trust the florist that we hired. She did one of my best friend's weddings, Gina's, and her flowers were so beautiful, so I'm just super excited about that. Anyway, back to what this video is about. Here is my freezer. Okay guys, here is my freezer. I did not do anything before this video. <laughs> Wanted to keep it very true life. This is my freezer. <laughs> um, I just picked these up at Costco. I love these. I shared these in my um, what to buy at Costco video. I will link that up in a card um, if you haven't checked it out. But these are so good. If you are on Weight Watchers, these are so low in points, yet they are so delicious. They're so easy. Steve and I have made wonton soup with these. Um, and then sometimes I just steam them. Sometimes I saute them in just a smidge of olive oil. And they are delicious. They are so good. Um, so I actually have a bag of them down below. We're going to finish those up. Um, I have strawberries, I have blueberries, um, what else? Okay, so, I mentioned Trader Joe's, so, love this sweet potato, sweet potato gnocchi, I think that's how you say it, um, and then, I haven't tried this one yet, but this is called the gnocchi... I'm not even going to pretend like I know how to say that, but it's um, tossed with tomato sauce and mozzarella cheese, so that looks really good. Um, that makes a really good side. Um, also love flounder fillets. Um, got these from Costco as well. These are really good and easy. They come individually wrapped, um, which makes um, for really easy preparation for if you only have like two people in your family. I just really like things that are pre-portioned and you don't have to open up a huge package. Um, that's one of the reasons that I love Costco. Um, this I took out of the box because the box was taking up too much room, but this is baked cod, also from Costco. Love this, we eat this very often. We put it on tacos, we put it on a salad and it makes a great protein. We love it. Um, randomly got some pierogies when they were on sale and then my mom gave us these apple strudel she got them from Aldi. Oh my gosh, they are so good. They're delicious. We had them when we were at their house and um, yeah, they were awesome. She put ice cream on top. So we're gonna treat ourselves to those hopefully this weekend. And then from Trader Joe's, I love Spanakopita, so does Steven. Um, it's basically just like a, Um, it's a really light, flaky pastry crust with spinach, ricotta cheese, and feta cheese. Um, they are not very high in calorie. You can have three of them for 160 calories and eight grams of fat, so not too, too bad, um, and six grams of protein. So these make a really good appetizer. Um, I've also had them for dinner before when I just didn't feel like making anything. I'll just make a couple of those um, for dinner. And then, oh. I really enjoy this. This is from Trader Joe's, the Mexican style roasted corn. Um, this is really good as a side. Um, if you're doing a Mexican night, it tastes very good. We love our tater tots, <laughs> tater tots. And then some ice cream. Um, these magnums, 
ice creams were on sale and I love those but typically I will have these mini Weight Watcher um, ice cream bars they're like little fudge bars and they are only two points I believe um, I have them in my app I can't remember exactly but they're low on point and they just satisfy the sweet tooth that I have and then meatballs so um, I'll be honest with you um, typically I get regular meatballs tried getting turkey meatballs this time to be a little bit more healthy I prefer the meat <laughs> like the beef meatballs um, but when I make spiralized zucchini aka zoodles I will throw in a bag of meatballs and it just makes it divine I do that with some sauce and it's delicious so that is our freezer let me show you what's in the fridge the fridge is a mess right now we have so many leftovers um, Steven made some Gatorade this is like taking up half the fridge um, usually we have sparkling water in here tonight we are having wings see uh, Steven seasoned these this morning um, we have some tomatoes some cheese I got this from Trader Joe's I haven't tried it yet but I'll keep y'all updated it is the super fruit spread um, I've never tried it like I said it was relatively low in sugar compared to other jellies um, this was eight grams of sugar for one tablespoon which is still kind of outrageous but I wanted to try it with some peanut butter this is basically our cheese drawer um, all types of shredded cheese um, I keep grapes need more grapes but I keep them um, easy to access that way when I'm feeling hangry and I just need something I can reach in very easily and grab a snack um, I love this Kerrygold butter. You can get this at Costco um, in the butter um, sticks. Um, but they had these, uh, was it two for six or two for five at Publix? So I picked that up. I always pick that up when it is on sale. I can't believe I'm showing you guys this. My fridge is usually pretty organized, and right now it doesn't look great. Um, and then I keep all of our snack cheeses in here. So if you want a quick snack, you can grab a cheese. And then um, I make like one cookie a night, one or two cookies a night for Steven and I. Um, so this is an easy way to do it. I feel like if I make all of them at once, then um, I just go overboard. And then we have some eggs. And then this drawer is also like a grab and, gr grab and go slash vegetable drawer. I keep hummus, um, some guacamole, um, have some leftover vegetables we are going to do some asparagus tonight we have some romaine lettuce and then we went for pizza last night and this is the only place I could fit the pizza um, I have some more chicken wings down here from Costco those are the chicken wings that we have up in the bowl that's marinating but these are awesome um, I shared these in the video as well and we turned out we it actually turned out that we love those and they're delicious and now we only buy the organic chicken wings and the price on them is excellent it was $12 for three packages of wings so so good over here I typically keep my white claws on hand just in case I have some chicken stock um, that I'll use for a crock pot recipe and then these are just all of our condiments and some of my prescriptions so yeah that is it that is what is in our refrigerator freezer so I don't know hopefully that was interesting for you guys I love seeing what people buy it gives me ideas um, but yeah I will see you guys in the next video. I hope you're having a great day and I will check in with y'all later. Bye. To a place where we don't know about to see.